morning, friends. We are loaded up and on our way to church on this very cold and sunny Sunday morning. It's not that cold, but it feels it's really cold. It's 34 degrees. Oh, it's 34 degrees. Okay, well, it is cold. That, that counts as cold. But you know what? Sunday hustle. My mouth is very dry right now, so my lips are sticking to my retainer, which was really awkward because somebody came up to talk to me after church and I was talking to her and I lit looked like this. And I couldn't like get my lip to go back over my teeth because they looked stuck. Anyways. Fix that problem, huh? Yeah. Did you enjoy church? Did you have a good time at church? Did you have a good time at church? I had a great time. You had a great time? Did you make new friends today? Or did you play with your, who did you play with? Cameron and Fun, fun. What did you do? What did you do, Rose? What did you learn? Uh, fun and uh, fun. You played with friends? And Ellie. Ellie? And uh, fun. Oh, that sounds like fun. And got a microwave. You colored? You colored? JJ, what about you? So funny, man. He was, I went to go pick him up in line, and they're like, Noah, Jonah, Rosie. And he comes in, he's just, the music starts playing, and he's just dancing. He can't not dance. His body just <laughs> loves the music. Excuse me, ma'am. Did you escape outside? Okay, call the dogs in. Miss Ivy decided that she did not want to be in the children's care this week, so Sierra walked her around for a little bit, and then I brought her. She brought her in service. I sat with her for a little while. My arms are really tired because either I held Benjamin or held Ivy for like an hour and a half, so my shoulders actually kind of hurt. I need to work on my vlogging shoulder muscles. But anywho, today is. It's the Sunday weekly prep, which looks like we did our meal plan last night. We're doing really good with this, you guys. A full week meal plan. We did that last night and placed the grocery order. And so today, we have one, we did a Costco and Walmart. So uh, Costco is being delivered via Instacart. And then we have a Walmart grocery pickup and Rosie and I, ha ha ha, and maybe some of the other kids too, are gonna go to the Asian market. You yeah, go to the Asian yeah. market and get some yummy snacks? Yes. Oh, and then we found out while we were at church that tonight there is a adoptive foster family community event tonight. So we went ahead and registered for that and we're gonna go and hopefully meet some of the other families at the church who are uh, foster parents or adoptive parents. That was one of the things that really drew us to this church was they have a huge community of uh, foster parents, adoptive parents, and so we're really excited to kind of meet everybody and hopefully get plugged in um, in that like area of the church, so. Yeah. Daddy's working on putting together Benji's little sit-me-up seat that we got him. Even the dogs have come to see the event. The great event of Benjamin sitting in a sit-me-up for the first time apparently draws the masses. Yes, and you're a big kid They can all relate. <laughs> Yeah, he's okay. He did, it's just a little bit of spit up. You like that, buddy? Can you see now? Yeah. She's taking your toys. She's taking your toys. She's playing with them. He's like, what? Okay, so today's vlog is sponsored by Drop App, and we've shared this app with you guys before. I love sharing things with y'all that don't cost you anything but save you money, and this app is super easy to use and does just that. 
Okay, so Drop App is a super easy to use rewards app. They basically give you points for shopping at your favorite stores like Trader Joe's, Sephora, Walmart. It's completely free to use and the points you earn basically turn into free gift cards that you can redeem on the app and use in stores again like Starbucks, Sephora, Best Buy, Amazon. It's really so easy to use. All you have to do is open up the app and then you select the brand offer on the shop page and then shop on that brand's uh, website or app as you normally would. And once you shop and check out, Drop takes care of the rest and adds the points into your account. And then when you're ready and you've got enough points, you can go to the redeem section and look at what's available to you for the amount of points that you have and redeem those points for your gift card. As you guys know, at the end of 2019, we had like a major budgeting conversation, especially as it pertains to what we were spending on like groceries and eating out and buying coffees and stuff like that so the reason I love this so much is because we're already shopping so like we get 20 points for every dollar we spend at Walmart so if we're buying our groceries there every week and we're spending like $250 on groceries that's gonna earn us like 5,000 drop points which then I can use to redeem for like I showed you guys on the app like Starbucks if I want to get that $50 Starbucks gift card and be able to get Starbucks for like two months or even redeem like the Old Navy gift card and you use that when we need to get new clothes for the kids and put that towards our clothing budget for kids. I just feel like this is money that you're already spending and then you're getting something back. To me, it's kind of like one of those no brainers. And the best part is that Drop has given y'all something a little extra. So for you guys, our vlog family, um, everybody will be receiving bonus points in the Drop app if you sign up through our link below. But they're gonna pick a 100 of you guys at random that will receive extra bonus rewards, which will range anywhere from $5 to $25 of rewards that you guys can redeem on the Drop app. So all you need to do to be eligible for that is to use the link down below in my description box to download the Drop app. Then you're going to link your card and you're gonna use my code TGN and you're all set. And that app is available in the Apple Store as well as Google Play. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. We all like to make a little extra money, especially for money that we're already spending. All right, I've gotta make our meal plan to go on the side of the fridge to replace that one, but I have it here. We have Taco Bake. Crack chicken chili, barbecue chicken, pot roast, salmon, ravioli, carnitas tacos. Then for our lunches, we have grilled cheese, quesadillas, butter noodles, macaroni and cheese, hot dogs, chicken salad sandwiches, taco soup, and pepperoni and feta pasta. Then breakfast, I took some of y'all's advice when I did that video on my other channels where I did the meal planning video. Um, and we're not gonna plan out breakfast so much, we're gonna have lots of options, except for certain days. So we have like pancakes, bagels, sausage, muffins, French toast, uh, breakfast sandwiches. And then I am going to do, I hear you. I hear you. And then I am going to do some, uh, a little bit of meal prep. And it's not even meal prep. Like I'm gonna do some snack prep. I wanna do um, a big thing of boiled eggs. And yeah, yeah. Um, just so that we have some things like that. Cause we obviously got like fresh fruit and stuff for the kids to snack on. Veggies, we're trying to buy some less of like the really snacky stuff. And we do, we, we are still buying like goldfish and stuff like that. But we're trying not to buy so much of that stuff. Boiled eggs are, I like eating them and grabbing them really quick for a quick protein jolt. Yeah. Do they sell this thing on Amazon? It's like the perfect hard-boiled egg cooker. That's what an Instant Pot is for. We have an Instant Pot, y'all. I need somebody to, we've used the Instant Pot only a couple times because it scares us both. But I've heard it's so good for cooking meat, um, like boiling, like doing like boiled eggs. You can do them in just a few minutes in the Instant Pot. So I, I need to bust that thing out. Maybe I'll do that later today. I don't know if I'll have time. We have to be back at church at five o'clock. I probably won't have time. The Instant Pot? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I won't use it. It's camper. We get the camper back tomorrow. Yeah, the camper is up getting uh, winterized and cleaned before we store it um, until we, we thought we might, we were planning on maybe going on the road in February again this year, but then life, you know, and we're just not able to make that work. So we're still figuring out when we're gonna get back on the road, but May probably. So I don't know. I think maybe we should just sell it. And no. Yeah. Just Airbnb it. It'll no. be easier. Uh, it's way more hey. expensive. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Checking out brother's seat? <laughs> what do you think? He's like, he, he likes the seat, but he also wants to be down here because he's trying to get himself up into crawling position. He can pull up his knees underneath him and he's starting to do that and then like get the rocking going. Yeah. 
I can. I know. I know what you're trying to do. You're trying to grow up and be a big boy and learn to crawl and all of that. And I'm not going to have any of it. It's okay, Ivy. Thank you. He's good. He's good. Thank you. Kids took the dogs for a walk because we still don't have a fence, so we have to walk them a bunch. Um, but when they get back from taking the dogs for a walk, a few of us are going to head to the Asian market, and CR is going to move all the um, pavers out of the way that you know, he put the pavers down from here to the to my office. He's moving them out of the way because the guys who are doing the fence have a what's it called? Dingo. It's called a dingo. No, did Ding not eat his baby. Ah, dingoes ate my baby. Um, so. Oh, you always got cut off from jokes, man. Um, so they have a dingo, and they're going to scrape out all that dirt for CR from the house out there so that he doesn't have to do that part, which is going to save him. Well, let's see. It took me about three hours to do eight rows. There's a hundred rows. So It's going to save him a lot of time. So that was really nice of them. So they're going to do that. So, But he's got to move all the cement pavers out of the way. Are you all ready? They're, they are. All right. Let's go. All right. We're locked and loaded. We got JJ. We got Rosie. We got Shelby. And we're off to the Asian market. Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah. We're here. Oh, he just he's up. alive. Whew. That's where he JJ wakes, sleeps I anywhere. All the time, Owie, like the car stops. I think he feels Mom. the pressure, and he's like, yeah. it's time to get Owie. out. Oh, I know. Are you okay? Wait, hold on, JJ. No, you got to no, unbuckle and stuff. Like, yeah. Have you guys ever seen the movie Renaissance Man? You know, the redheaded character Melvin JJ. Melvin, who Mom. sleeps on his desk all the time. That's what Jonah JJ. reminds me of. He like sleeps anywhere. Melvin Melvin. Here at the Asian market. Okay, you want to pick out some of your favorite snacks? And then we go into the sweet section. You want yeah. some of those? <laughs> oh, it's. You want some of those? Yeah. I okay, do. hold those. What else? Ooh. I think the little cracker things that you like are on this other side. These are my favorite, the digestives. Okay, come over here. These, but she likes the ones that have the little, you like the ones that have the little sugar on top, right? Ooh, cookie. Is it these ones? Yeah, that'll work. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> are you talking to the fish? Me in the shower. This is me in the shower. Gross. Me too. What do you see, JJ? I just, I just stand underneath the water. I'm being honest with you. I don't even. We got some crab shelves and some octopus. There's some octopus down there. Oh, there's the geo ducks. Crawfish. Crawdaddy. Oh, wait, mom. Those are similar to what we. Yeah, those are alive. Don't touch them. They're still alive. They are. They're alive. They're moving. All right, Rose, get buckled. I'm gonna get you one of your. One of your snacks. JJ, how's the smoothie? All right, you gotta get buckled. All right, there was a weird guy, a guy in the Asian market that every time we turned around, he was behind us in the aisle and I did the same thing to the kids because I wanna freak him out, but I left the camera rolling while we were getting in the car just in case, just in case he tried something I needed like photographic evidence or video proof because it was really weirding me out. Um, Always got to have your head on a swivel, you know, especially when you're out with your kids and you're distracted. By I get kids. freaked out like that on jogs. Whenever yeah. I'm on a jog, anytime a car is like going slow past me, I go, oh my goodness, why is they're trying to pick me up off the curve? Yeah. So you got to gotta have your wits stuff. about you, but looks like all is well. I actually don't see him. Oh, and I closed my dress in the door. Hold on. Um, all right. Now we are going to head to the Wally World. Walmart, whatever, and pick up our groceries. How's your snacks? Good. You love it? Ah. <laughs> How's your strawberry Good. smoothie? He got a uh, bubble added to his. Oh, oh lovely. I don't even know what bubble was. I expected it to be carbonation, but it's actually just big chunks of fruit that are yeah, like frozen mom. in some kind of like. Mom? I'm pretty sure it's called. Nobody attacked me for this, but I'm pretty sure it's called liquid nitrogen. But liquid I nitrogen? I don't think I'm right. I don't know, but let's it's see like it. Jelly Maybe, bubbles. well, if we had comments, somebody could tell us, but what are the bubbles in bubble tea and in bubble drinks? Like, it feels like... Uh, just like frozen. I think it's just frozen. Uh, yeah. for, I don't know. We could Google it, I suppose. Uh, so, we just got here to Walmart to pick up our grocery order, and we come hadn't on. got the pickup notice yet, but I figured it's, you know, 15 minutes away, so we just go ahead and come here. So, I pulled up, parked, and called, and they were like, oh, sorry, we, we we're letting everybody know we're canceling all the they orders got, for today. cookies! Cookie! So, 
no groceries. <laughs> Gonna have to uh, do it the old fashioned way. Mm. We've got the groceries, they have been secured. We're gonna get all these put away, and then we need to leave in 15 minutes. Hey buddy, we need to leave in 15 minutes to get to the church community event. All right, go brush your hair, make sure you're ready to go. We're gonna put away groceries. Do you need something? You want some milk, please? Thank you, you want some milk, please? Yeah. Yes, woohoo! Ivy's enjoying some of the crackers from the Asian market. You like those? Last time we got um, some different snacks. Rosie picked out some different ones last time we went and Rosie didn't end up liking them, but the twins did and they ate a bunch of them. I don't remember what they were. They were like the little the little round ones. Hi ho, hi ho. It's back to church we go. And we're heading back up to the church for the adoption foster care community night. Uh, we've not been to one of these before, so we don't know what to expect. We did get an email a little while ago that said that they were going to be serving pizza for the little kids. So they're all pretty jacked about that. 